Leo, welcome back to the channel Emperor's Light. It's me, Tony. With another set of channel tarot card message for you guys today, Fire Sign. So we're going to get into your love and romance energies. See what's currently surrounding you, what's permeating your energies, what's coming towards you. So don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel so that we continue to grow and put out more of these messages for the Leo Collective. All right. So we've been getting some good messages so far. We're not going to spend too much time on the intro. We're going to jump right into you guys' reading today and see what spirit wants to let you know. Don't forget to check your moon, rising, Venus placements. And get more clarification on the love energy surrounding you and the romantic energies coming towards you as well. All right. Messages for the fire sign, Leo, today. Spirit, what do you have for the Leos? What's today's therapeutic storytelling for Leo? Get a bit of love exorcism going on here, right? <laughs> All you need is a little bit of love and attention for the Leos, right? <laughs> Let's get into your message, Leo. A couple more shuffles, and we'll see what spirit wants to start off with you. Nice and sunny day for the fire sign, Leo Collective. Your grounded message today is going to be the page of embers. So I'm getting like a short, brisk walk out in the sun. That's good for you, vitamin D. So this could even be like some sort of an exercise routine. Uh, not too stressful. This could be like yoga or something for you as well. Interesting, that's the first time I got yoga today. Could be dealing with a uh, an amateur, I was going to say child, which pages tend to be, right? They tend to be amateurs or immature, but this could be like an immature actor or something like that. Again, like a small hike or a small walk. This could even be like a young content creator or an amateur content creator. We're getting the Six of Storms. Right? So some sort of a mental release, sort of a stress reliever. There may be something, I mean, it actually is a stress reliever. Going on like small walks and hikes and things like that, getting out of the city, two, 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 just showing up on the timer, right? Getting out, doing small walks, exercising, even content creation, right? Art is a way for us to express our emotions. That if we don't get those emotions out, it becomes toxic at some point. So yeah, someone's clearing their mental state through exercise. Possibly we have the devil showing up, major arcana. So the devil is Capricorn energy, right? To be any earth sign, Virgo or Taurus, they tend to be very, um, I wouldn't necessarily say materialistic, they just, just like to be abundant, right? They like to be comfortable. The devil could be some sort of a leader or an entrepreneur or a CEO, even, right? Yeah, you get a you, you do a lot of work, you want that mental uh, stress reliever or even a physical stress relief, right? Some of the toughest jobs out there, I have to keep telling people, even a job that's easy, like probably hear my AC going off right now right and throughout my life I've um, worked in call centers right inside nice air seed windows um, <laughs> nice AC uh, buildings but even then you deal with things mentally uh, stressful right and it weighs on your body physically because again if you don't detox that stuff out of your system it becomes a burden on you right I go over mentioning like just like sweating right getting out uh, and about and sweating you're sweating out um, your, your body's detoxing out whatever uh, bad energies that you've absorbed. And dreaming is the same way. Dreaming is your body's way of detoxing um, certain emotions and certain um, mental thoughts that you have been, um, you know, locked up inside you, right? Sometimes we manifest uh, our fears or even nightmares uh, without us intending to do so. It's because you have those things bottled up inside you, right? So... We also have five. So, I mean, this feels like competition, but it doesn't really necessarily have to be, right? There's multiple stories, obviously, multiple, multiple people watching. But I'm getting more of like a self-workout regimen, right? You may be in competition with yourself, right? Which is what most people say. I'm not in what competition with you. I'm in, I'm in competition with me, right? <laughs> Especially if you're a boss or a CEO or some sort of a leader, right? <laughs> How much competition do you have, right? So you're literally competing with yourself to, to stay at the top of the mountain or to better yourself, right? We have temperance, the earth angel, right? The scientist, the mixologist, right? 
could be dealing with a therapist even, right? Someone may be going to see some sort of a, a therapist or some sort of a spiritualist. Yeah, the devil is typically known as possessiveness, right? Or an obsession. And then a temperance comes out in the balance, right? That would be the spiritualist. That would be the uh, exorcist, right? So a devil or possession or a demon in exorcism, right? Take time. All this hard work, you need to detox, right? Bring balance, right? So whether that's some sort of a mental, maybe you need to write out your thoughts, right? Six of swords or have a conversation with someone. Again, if someone could be going to see a therapist, this could even be self-talk, right? And uh, of course, the physical activity, right? Sometimes, um, and this is funny, right? Um, if, you, if you are used to working out and going on, uh, you know, having a gym regimen or going on adventures and hikes and that sort of thing, five 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 once you stop it throws you off completely right <laughs> your body even starts to ache right because it's not used to getting the exercise that it needs right everything is a muscle you don't use it you lose it your last message two of gems yeah so this could be starting some sort of a health journey or uh, trying to maintain some sort of a health journey right balancing two of pinnacles typically gives me libra energy so that could be a balance of your finances and a balance of like work and home life balance right or even health right someone's trying to balance those your bonus message under the page of embers is going to be the king of bubbles yeah so you need some sort of a detox some sort of an exorcism again this could be the romantic energies coming towards you a king of bubbles right so this could be like a massage therapist some sort of a healer a singer a dancer right maybe a comedian a storyteller or something like that right mm-hmm acupuncture even just wanted to throw in there but yeah definitely two major arcana so uh it could be a capricorn or a sagittarius coming towards you so some sort of a leader or guru coming towards you um if you are a leader or a guru it would be encumbered upon you to keep the people around you uh healthy right this would be like scheduling a scheduling a health day for your employees it could be like a picnic or a beach day or something like that right or a selfies day or something like that you need to do to keep these people happy but that is what i have for you here today leo definitely um for the most part i didn't really pick up any negativity to be in, although we did see the devil coming toward coming coming up in a reading but that could just be someone very sexually attractive very talented coming towards you or a temperance type right a sagittarius coming towards you some sort of a teacher or guru or leader right i'm getting a lot of fun here though for whatever reason mm -hmm. yeah so again, the balance, maybe it's like a game day or something like that, like a mental stress reliever or something like that, either in a relationship or for a group of business associates. But like, share, subscribe, add value to the channel. Catch you guys on the next one. Peace, Leo.